We live in a society where rich people swim in money and the poor start to death. Outside there are unfortunate people who only live to survive day by day, from a very young age with long working journeys in the direct sun. So why do poor people survive every day suffering so much if there are so many rich people who do not care more than enjoy the luxuries when they have the money to end this? Why not better to avoid and reject them? We help them to get ahead. Not to have to wake up every day by day, knowing that they will always remain in the same hole. Why don't we put our prejudices aside and support ending this inequality that only hardens people's heart? If we do all of this, they won't end up getting high or having to resort to selling to support their families. The world has enough for everyone's need, but not enough for everyone's greed. Gandhi. Okay, okay, okay. All of that is true, and nobody likes it. But why don't we look for an effective solution? First, we need to know the problem, probably to find a solution. So, what is social inequality? It's the existence of unequal opportunities and rewards for different social positions or status within a group or society. This is something that affects all the people. Doesn't matter your race, your age, or where you come from. In Mexico, 52.4 million live in poverty a figure that is equivalent to 41.9% of the population and also this represents a decrease of only 2.5% compared to the percentage registered in 2008 when the percentage was 44.4 One solution will be to demand opportunities not equal but fair instead we have to stop seeing possession before people because a poor person who is good worth more than the riches without power. That's our solution, to see people instead of pawns, disposable and interchangeable. We need to help, but truly really help, for their good. Begin a society where there's no social wall, and start to behave as humans, not beasts. When that happens, we can be sure that we made a better world. <laughs>